Order. End of question time. The clerk will now proceed to read the orders of the day. Item 1. The Committee of Supply to consider the supplementary estimates of expenditure for the financial year 1st April 2018 to 31st March 2019. <coughs> supplementary estimates of expenditure for the financial year 1st April 2018 to 31st March 2019 contained in Paper Command 20 of 2019. I shall deal first with the Head of Expenditure, in respect of which an amendment stands on the Order Paper Supplement. Head K, Ministry of Education, Associate Professor Walter Tessera. Chairman, I beg to move that the total sum to be allocated for Head K be reduced by $100 in respect of Code 3000. Uh, Mr. Chairman, I declare my interest as a faculty member in an autonomous university. The supplementary estimates provide $300 million to the ministry, mainly to meet higher than expected endowment matching grants to the autonomous universities. I commend the generosity of Singaporeans in donating to our autonomous universities, and I thank the ministry for, pro for providing a 1.5 times matching grant for the three older universities and a three times matching grant for the three newer universities. However, I am concerned about how the ministry budgets for these matching grants. While our universities receive many donations from alumni and the public, donations are typically small. The gift of a major donor is several orders of magnitude larger than the average donation. For example, in 2011, the Lee Foundation gave $150 million to fund the Lee Kong Chien School of Medicine at Nanyang Technological University. The government match was $250 million. In contrast, from 2015 to 2018, NTU's average donations were only about $35 million in, uh, per year. So one big donation can be many times the value of total annual donations in a typical year. Sir, donations can also fluctuate significantly year to year, even if there are no landmark donations. For the four years from 2015 to 2018, NTU's donations range from 16 million to 53 million uh, each year. For NUS, the range was 156 million to 276 million. So the required matching grants from government will also range widely. I'm glad the Minister for Finance discussed when closing the budget uh, debate how the government works hard to ensure forecasts of revenue and expenditure are accurate. So first, could the Education Ministry outline how it budgets for the typical year-to-year -year variation in donation receipts by our AUs? Second, what is the planning process to manage the impact of a big grant on the Ministry's budget? We have not had a billion dollar donation to universities yet in Singapore, but I hope we will soon. And that would make a big impact to the government budget. Thank you.